Hello guys, are you new to WordPress? Are you trying to figure out how to install the WordPress theme? Well, this is Matt Victor and today I'm going to take you through the process of installing a WordPress theme. A WordPress theme will allow you to control the design and look of your WordPress website. This includes the colors, the page layout and the font. You can use either a free theme or a premium theme. To choose a WordPress theme, you will be required to select appearance, then you will head to the navigation section. Now, to install a new theme, you will be required to press on the add new button and you will be directed to a directory of themes. You can then search, filter and scroll down and choose the theme that you want. The preview button is always available to help you preview how your site or rather your website is going to appear once you install a given theme. If you're happy with the given theme, you can then click the install button. You can then after that use the customization tool to customize the theme that you have selected. You can change identity color, background image, menu and widget. Now. I will now go to the process of installing. Now I have got a WordPress theme here. No, I've got a WordPress blog here for illustration purposes. Now we'll go to appearance. Then we're going to scroll up to the theme. So remember, I have already installed certain themes here. But if you are doing this for the first time, you will likely find this place empty but since I've, I've installed 26 themes so far that is why they appear now let us assume that there are no themes here now what we are going to do we are going to press on the add new once you have pressed on the add new button you will be waiting you will wait as you'll be redirected to this page. Now, we have got the featured, we have got the popular, we have got the latest, we have got the favorite. So, I, I do not have any favorite yet. So, these are the latest themes and you can see how they appear. Let us assume for instance that I want to install this theme. I will simply come here and click on it. Once I'm here, this is how my theme is going to appear. So I'm not, I do not want to install this theme. So I will simply go back. And this is the entire process. So you can see the different types of websites that you can install. Let us preview this. Yeah, you can see this again another theme that you can consider installing. But again, I will not want to install this particular one. So like I told you earlier on, you can see already I have got certain themes on my dashboard. Some of these themes, I had tried them before. Like you can see, my current theme is Astra. Now, Astra gives you several options eh, that you can always utilize and to make a suitable website. Before I go to Astra, Let's, there are certain events whereby you are going to purchase a premium theme. Like in this case, I've got this theme from Series Magazine and Blog, WordPress theme, that was purchased at themeforest.net. Now, to install such a theme, you'll simply require to download. So I will come here and click on this installable on WordPress file only. I'll click on it.
so I will wait for the download process to finish once the download process is finished I will now come here then add new then I will scroll down upload theme I will click on upload theme my just give it time I should be able to get another window so I can then choose the file it's in the download section I believe here it is then I'll press on install now so the installation process will begin you can see it's uploading six percent seven percent down here so the installation is taking place so i will patiently wait i'll patiently wait for the installation to continue order to finish so wordpress is a very very powerful tool so as I was saying, you do not have to necessarily use the premium theme. We have got, we have got, ve we have got several options that are free that you can equally utilize. As you can see, I had earlier on talked about Astra. And once you have installed Astra, we usually have several starter templates that you can always try them out. I'm going to show you some of these data templates by just opening this in another tab. So you can see the process is done, I believe. The process is done. <coughs> Sorry for that. So, for the starter templates, you can see, again, when it comes to this, we have got various options. We have certain templates that are made for business, blogs and e-commerce. So, agency are premium themes. So, for our case, we want to go for free themes. You will simply click on on, on free so that it filters them out and as you can see we have got several themes here that you can be able to either adopt and just customize so I like the practicability of things that is why I'm trying to illustrate this so I'm looking for I'm looking for for a theme. Eh? I think this one this one is cute. Yes. I can consider this. I can see it. Oh my my internet opted up. So for this, let's say you want to install the Astra starter packs. You can always click on import complete site. Mm, skip and update I want it to delete the previously installed theme so the process is taking place you can see this is the site that we are trying to install a new plugin for it's called scribe for jesus i just want to to select another you can see already 
the the installation of the template is taking place oh i don't know what happened i just restarted it but in a nutshell i have just shown you the process of uploading a, a premium theme so the process is similar again once you have installed you can always go ahead oh destination folder already exists installing the theme it failed for some reason so i think it's maybe because i've used it in another website that could be the reason now we'll wait for this other one so you can see the installation process has finished since it has finished you can see now this is how it appears now what i would be required to do is to customize this so i will go to customize customize Want to customize the various options here so i will need to change these all these details so i will go to okay those can remain for now i will go to header the site identity and you see my scribe is like my my site is scribe for jesus so if i had a logo I will simply click here remove or other change and I will I will quickly change that for different retina devices it's actually for different devices I don't need to have for different devices then you've got the site icon the site icon is this that actually appears on the on the WordPress so again the process is very simple once you have installed your desired changes you will click on publish and they are going to change then there are also other aspects here that might need to be changed now to do that simply come here visit site just to open the site then click edit page with Elementor now once you're here you can see you can always change this you can for instance say style for givers you can always update it I can proceed and say mainstream now this will be like my landing page so I'm going to customize it accordingly you can always check in later but for the purposes of this video I simply wanted to show you how to install a WordPress theme which I've done now what I'm going to do is now customizing. Thank you for taking time to watch my videos and even thank you for the love for subscribing to my YouTube channel. In the event you have any question, in the event you have any topic that you want I cover, kindly feel free to ask. Thank you and may God bless you.